this uh, this training session with some dumbbell bench. Uh, this was my accessory day. Uh, no main lift. Uh, I started out with doing 75s for uh, two AMRAP sets. And over here I get uh, 17, I believe. Yeah, 17 and I fell the lockout on the 18th, I think. Uh, I was a bit disappointed with this since I used to do uh, with 80s, 15 uh, reps. And that was after benching that I did that. So uh, I was kind of disappointed that I only got 17, 17 here. Uh, however, uh, when I got 80s, uh, for 15, the second set of 80s, I only got like I think seven or eight, and here on the second set of 75s, I got uh, 15 reps, I believe, and fell the 16th uh, lockout. So I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, and also the, the the 80 pound dumbbells, I did it with my feet in the air. I was Larson pressing it, so it was a tiny bit harder, and I actually managed to to, to push more than today. But we're gonna get there. Uh, right here is the 45 uh, degree back raise with uh, 225 on the bar. Uh, pretty niche exercise, but honestly, it's probably my second favorite accessory after um, what is it called? Uh, deficit deadlifts uh, to increase your deadlift by far. I, I really like this exercise. I feel like this is uh, the type of exercise that makes me keep my back straight in a deadlift. If you do, if you do these a lot, it's gonna like prevent you from rounding your back because this is like pretty much. This is a lot of hamstring work here, uh, a bit of glute, but I feel like it just makes your back tighter during the deadlift. I don't know why. Uh, it's just an amazing exercise. You should be doing this. It honestly, even in a maybe not a, in a bodybuilding purpose, but just for just you know having a good good lower back strength and health uh oh yeah and it's zero dangerous like like honestly i i could not see myself hurting my back here uh ever uh i i, I, I it doesn't round my back doesn't round uh, i i couldn't see a possibility of hurting my back so it's uh, i honestly really recommend this uh so i did two sets of i was supposed to do two sets of 12 i got 12 on the first uh set uh, it was pretty hard, like an RP9, could have gotten maybe one more m tops. Uh, here on the second set, I believe I got nine, might be eight, not too sure. Uh, and on the last rep, yeah, I got eight, but the ninth rep was really iffy. Uh, the lockout wasn't really there. Uh, I was just really burnt out by lower back, so I wasn't able to lock it out. Uh, I also used the smaller diameter 45 plates to have a slightly bigger range of motion. I think that's the 8th or ninth set. Uh, rep, sorry. Yeah, n a ninth rep right there, you see. I uh, pretty much didn't lock it out, so it's 8.5, let's say. Um, I also did some accessory work for my rear delts, since it's it's really super important to keep your shoulders healthy if you do a lot of, uh, of pressing. Considering that I'm pressing three times a week right now, so uh, yeah, uh, some rear delt fries with 20 pounds, and then for the th uh, three other sets, I put uh, 30 pounds, which is a bit heavy, but there's no 25 pound uh, possibility, so I just have to go a bit heavier since 20 pounds was just too light. Uh, I'm just gonna fast forward through this because it's just really boring with a shitty angle to uh, bodybuilding work. Well, I find it boring at the release. Not really intense or anything. Uh, yeah, just just do this if you don't want to have any like shoulder pain. Literally, any person that I know that has or had shoulder pain and seen a physiotherapist about it has just told them to do just more rear, rear delt work, and that's me included. Uh, right here is some barbell curls with 60 or 65. No, I think it's 60. Yeah, 60 pounds. Uh, my my, my biceps are honestly really like probably one of my worst body part um, they don't grow at all I think my arms are barely 16 inches wide and uh, wide I mean uh, and in circ uh, circumference uh, I can't I can't uh, curl for for shit honestly I'm just not strong there uh, yeah I did uh, four sets of 20 and the two last sets were really I was swinging a lot because it was just getting too heavy all right this was the the workout guys of 
uh, accessory work, and we'll be back next week with, uh, well, next week, in three days for the second week, uh, starting back with uh, mainly pressing, deadlifting, and squatting for the three first workouts, and the road to a 1,200 total. All right, see you guys.